really happy that two a days are over, camp's over, and now we get into our regular seasonal routine. The next couple weeks, we finally get to hit somebody else besides ourselves, so that, that's always a good thing. Compared to last year, we look just 10 times better. We're a lot more focused. We all want to be here. We all want to work hard and have a good season. You know, we don't have as many injuries. We have a bunch of guys that benefited from those injuries that came back and are basically second year guys who've been in the system. They know what we expect. And, you know, I, I think it's going to be a great year for us. Over the past few weeks, we've been doing two days. We've been out here for hours. And every single week, we, uh, we practice for three days with pads on to get ready for the game. So. It takes, it's, a, it's a lot of work. Well, right now we're getting ready for our Thousand Oaks scrimmage on Friday. But scrimmage is very important because of the competition aspect. We want to see where we're at. Thousand Oaks is always good. And we know Coach Leibman's going to throw a good offense and a good defense against us. So we want to be able to compete with that. We play in the Pacific View League, and I think that's kind of been looked down upon in the last few years. But this year we're going to show that teams at Pacific View League are really, you know, a formidable opponent to everybody. I remember when I was playing out here on this field, and I could not wait for Fridays. And I know they feel the same way. So we're really looking forward to the scrimmage against Thousand Oaks. And then the real deal begins against Newbury Park. And yeah, they're, they're chomping at the bit. They want to get going. And I'll tell you what, our, our schedule's not easy. We have some tough games coming up. We all, we all saw what we went through last year. And none of us were satisfied with this. Five and six is not something to be proud of. You know, our goal is to win three championships. If people are going to listen to this and go, whatever. But, you know, that's, that's what we're going to do. So hopefully we're out there and tear it up. And I think we have the team to do it. Our motto this year is last play. How are they going to remember you? What's your last play going to be like? Last year, Joey Valdez's last play on defense was an interception against Real Mesa that he ran back for a touchdown and unfortunately got called back by a penalty. Charles Baca's last play on offense was a touchdown that beat Real Mesa. So every play is your last play, so play it hard. That's what we're doing.